Hey art friends, welcome to today's how-to. Today we'll be learning how to draw a Barbie. So first let's get started by coming up towards the top right hand side of our page. And we're going to start by drawing a nice big circle for our right eye. Let's move over towards the left side now, lining that up at the same height. And we're just going to draw another circle for our left eye. Moving into the corner of both eyes now, we're going to draw a small circle for the highlight of the eye. And then again, we'll do the same thing on the left. Moving around that now, in the middle, we're going to draw another circle for the pupil of the eye. And now one more time, coming further out, we're going to start on the top and we're just going to draw a curved line that curves all the way around, connecting that in, blending it in on the bottom. And we'll do the same thing over on the left. To the corner of both eyes now, we're going to draw a small curved line that arches up and then back in for the eyelash. Moving in towards the middle now for the nose, we're going to draw a small curved line in the center. On either side of that now, we're going to curve our line around and then in. Dropping below that now, over on the left hand side, we're going to draw a small curved line that arches up. And then moving over to the right, leaving an even amount of space, we'll do the same thing. Starting back on the left hand side now, in the center, we're going to draw a curved line that stretches all the way over. On the bottom, we're going to draw a nice big arch line for our bottom lip, curving that back up. Moving in the center now, we're going to draw an arch line that curves up and then down on the left. And now starting back on the center here, we're going to curve this line up towards the top and then over on the right. Now we're going to come in and frame in the hair. So moving directly in towards the middle, coming up to the center, we're going to curve a line that stretches all the way around and bringing that over towards our left eye. And then over on the right, we're gonna come further down and we're just going to curve this down and over towards our right eye. Moving back over towards the left hand side, now we're going to curve this line up slightly, and then we'll do the same thing over on the right. Moving back over to the left side now, starting up a little bit higher, we're going to start by curving this line in, bringing this across towards our eye, and then curving that around and then in towards the middle. Moving over to the right, we're going to start just a little bit higher again, and we're going to curve this line around towards our eye and then arching that back up. And now just like we did over on the left, we're going to come up, line that up at the same height. We're going to curve that in, bring that over towards our eye, and then arch that over and in towards the center again. Now from here, we're going to connect this. So starting in the top again, moving over slightly towards the left, we're going to curve this line all the way around. And we'll just connect that at the point on the left-hand side. Moving over towards the center again, we're just going to replicate this, curving this all the way around and then connecting that on the right. Now underneath here, we can close off the bottom of the face. So starting on the left hand side, we're going to curve this line around, bringing it over and in towards the center. And then moving over to the right, let's replicate that, curving that around and then blending that in towards that line. Next, we're going to draw in the eyebrows. So over on the right hand side, we're going to draw a curved line that arches around go underneath that hair strand and then curve that over and out towards the right. Now from here at the point, we're going to curve this up, bringing that again in towards the hair and then continuing that underneath. Moving over towards the left now, we're going to draw a straight line that comes down on the left. On that bottom line now, we're going to curve this all the way around, bringing that over and in towards the side. And then now from here, starting at the point, we're going to curve this up and then connecting that on our top line there. Now let's move in towards the left and right and draw on the ears. So coming up further on our hair here, we're going to draw a curved line that arches all the way around and then in. And then we'll just do the same thing over on the left. For our earrings now in the corner, we're just going to draw a small circle on the bottom. Now coming further down on either side, we're going to draw a small circle, just making that slightly bigger.
And then around this, we're going to draw our flower pattern. So on the top, we're just going to curve this up and in, and we're going to continue to follow this pattern as we come all the way around in a circle motion. And then we're just gonna do the same thing on the left. Now to connect these together, we're just going to draw a straight line that comes up towards that circle on the ear. And now let's move it underneath and draw on the body. So over on the left hand side, we're going to draw a straight line that comes down. Moving over to the right, we'll replicate that. Now from here, we're going to close this off with a curved line from left to right. Inside of here now, we're going to draw three small circles for the necklace. So one in the center, coming over towards the right. And then again over on the left. Now let's frame in the rest of the dress. So moving further over on the outside, we're going to curve this line all the way over and out towards the bottom of our page. And then we'll do the same thing over on the right. Now from here, we're going to close this off with a curved line from left to right. Moving in towards the middle, we're going to draw a curved line from left to right again. And then dropping below that one more time, leaving an even amount of space, we'll replicate that. In the middle now, we're going to draw a nice big circle where the belt is. And then moving inside of that one more time, we're going to draw an even smaller circle. In the middle now, as we come down, we're just going to draw a straight line. Over on the left, we're going to draw a diagonal line that comes out. And then we'll do the same thing as we come over towards the right. Now let's come in and frame in our arms. So over on the left hand side, we're going to curve this line all the way around, arching that in. And then we'll do the same thing on the right. Now from here on the inside for the thumb, we're going to curve this line down, up, and then arching that back in towards our dress. And we'll do the same thing over on the right. And then now from here in this open space, we're going to continue to draw the rest of the fingers. So coming just up above the thumb, we're going to curve this line down, arching that around and then in. And we'll do the same on the right. And then one more time, we'll replicate that. So curving this around, bringing this up. Now on our right hand side, we're going to draw on the bracelet. So we're going to draw some more circles as we come across on our wrist. And we're just gonna try and make those even sizes. Now coming in underneath, let's draw on the legs. So on the left-hand side, we're going to draw a straight line that comes down, and we'll do the same thing on the right. Moving further out now, we're going to draw another straight line that comes in on either side, making that shorter. And then we're gonna close this off with a curved line connecting that on either side. Now on the outer portion, we're gonna start in the corner, curving this line around and then down for the shoe. And then we're gonna come in underneath and close this off with a curved line from left to right. Let's step up a little bit higher and replicate that for the sole of the shoe. And now coming up above, we're going to draw a curved line that arches around and then out on either side. Lastly, we're just gonna come in and frame in the hair from behind. So coming over further up towards the left, we're going to start by curving this line out, arching this in, and then curving that back out towards the left-hand side. And we're gonna replicate this on the right. So we're gonna move over slightly here. We're gonna curve this line down, arching that in, and then curving that back out, ending this at roughly the same height. Now starting at that point, we're going to curve this line back in towards the middle. Now at that corner there, we're going to curve this line around and in towards our dress on either side. Again, ending this at the same height. And then now from here, we're just going to arch this line over and in towards our dress. 
And that is it, that's how you draw Barbie. You can pause the video and color it the way that I have done, or you can change your colors up if you'd like. If you enjoyed today's video, please hit that thumbs up button and subscribe to the channel, and also drop a comment below suggesting any more characters that you'd love to learn to draw next. Thanks so much for joining me on today's tutorial, and I will see you all in the next one.